All right, so this video is for Aries from now through November. You know what? I actually wanted to do something different, so give me a second. Okay, to my own recollection. Okay, guys. So we're gonna do the reading slightly different. I'm sorry about I'm sorry about the ads. I really am. I can't. I used to have so much music on my computers. I don't. And then once they die, that's sort of it. All right. So we're gonna do this. Sincerely for Aries this time. Aries. All right. Let's do this for Aries. Yeah. Facebook. Divine messages, messages that resonate. Just making sure that they're right side up because I don't like a reading with a bunch of upside down cards. Don't I, throw the whole reading away, okay? Do not want a bunch. My homegirl pulled for me Wednesday and I like eight out of the 10 cards were, were upside down. I was like, just throw the whole reading away. I don't even want it. <laughs> Let's go. Let's see. Oh, shit. Aries. Yay. Mm. Okay. This is a new beginning, Aries. I like this. Okay, so let me slow down. Your current situation. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful card. So these are thoughts from the heavens. These are downloads. These are those subtle those subtle ideas that come to us throughout the day. And Aries is so busy. And we don't want to keep a notebook, but it would behoove us to keep a notebook. But we need to. So if you do, and you're getting these divine messages, you know how to move forward. Okay? You get kind of get over the excuses and into the divine. When we follow our passion and our purity, right? Then we have growth. Right? So that's that's opportunity. Whenever we see an ace, it's opportunity. Got a lot of, you got a few majors here, Aries. That's the current situation. So what do we need to do with this? What action do we need to put with this? Um, ace of wands. We have more opportunity, creative opportunity from the heavens. Fertility, the ground is fertile right now. Like, Aries, just go, reach out and snatch the shit. It, now, it, it, I couldn't even tell you a better time than now. Maybe between now and the Jupiter transit. I'm telling you, it's about to be on and popping. I got Sagittarius in the seventh house. Progress. Hey, don't don't let me Millie rock. I'm not going to start Millie rocking because I'm not going to be able to stop. <laughs> All right. So... What you want to do with this energy is, again, once you can, um, once you start making moves with this energy, because now you already have the idea, you already have the opportunity. Now you have to put. Now you have the creative influence, and then on top of that, you got the King of Wands. So for some of us, this is a male. For if you're a female, this is a guy that comes into your life, and it's very fiery. Maybe he's a Sag. He's got some sort of heavy Sag. Aries or Leo energy. I'm so sorry. The fucking commercials are killer. I have a Virgo Stellum and it makes me nuts. 
kind of shit. All right, that's smooth. I'll leave it. So anyway, this could be a possible. This could be a, this could be the energy that we need to take on at this time to be aggressive with what it is that we wanna that we want to bring forth. My hand off my face. But balancing the energies, the create this create there, there's creative opportunities, but we just have to go for it, especially right now. Catch the catch this tapering full moon energy. Catch it while you can. Because I know I was getting it in and I already see the opportunities. I literally got, I went for one opportunity, literally, literally heard back from them within like 60 minutes. True story. Okay. Judgment. Aries is being hard on the self right now. But there's a new beginning. I think Aries is sort of like, okay, what am I going to do? Where am I going to go? How am I going to do this? Where am I going to get it done? How am I going to get it done? There's so many things I got to do. And Aries' mind never stops going. Hey, Keys. Keys up on it. Jackson. But it's a new beginning. Not to be frivolous, though. I feel like this is a strong, yes, yes, options. The worst is over. But there's stability coming as well. Maintain. Oh, look at what's at the bottom. Aries, it's Poppington for us. Look at that. Yay. Yay. Body roll. All right, I need something a little bit funkier than this. Let me play some funk. Good. I'm glad you are, Miss Yolanda. Let's see. I like this. I mean, look. You know, people will have the Aries think we're hard to love. We're not. Niggas just fucking play too much with us and we don't like it. Aries is not the one you could play games with. Yeah, we, we do have a lot going on, and then we keep a lot of it in our head. That's why it's good to at least write shit down. But um, if you're dealing relationally with an Aries, just be respectful. If you're respectful and you tell us shit at a certain, if you tell us some real shit, but you're so genuine about it, we have no choice but to respect you. I'm telling you, it sounds crazy. People think that they can't tell the Aries the truth. You're better off telling us the truth because we're going to find out anyway. Aries is master. Y'all think that Scorpio is something. Let an Aries have a Scorpio friend. We on the pull up. Hmm. Play if you want. Like I said, Aries knows who to respect. Hi, Miss Betty. Aries knows who to respect. <laughs> we know. Long as you got ties to it, Aries, y'all know y'all live in the same community and know the same people, or your families know each other somehow, then you don't gotta worry about the Aries acting stupid. Oh, that's what I was saying. Hi, Scorpio Rising. My mom is Scorpio Rising. Oh wait, but I was finished with these. I'm so excited about this. Good lord. But this is good because whoever this is that's coming along, it's a fair exchange of energy. Thank God this. This is a Knight of Cups. It might be a little bit younger than you. Um, doesn't necessarily have to be a water sign, but they're just willing to give some love. Thank God. Woo. I think I'm going to leave that right there. Oh, and this person takes out the, the nails that were in your heart. Like, they reverse the whole, all the bullshit that you've been through. And look. Turns into the king. Walk it like he talk it. You're welcome, Miss Yolanda. Amen. That's Leo. Leo goes hard too. Hi, Miss Betty. Love you too. Team Aries all day, every day. Pluto in the 12th. Ooh, what is that like, Bryce Nia? Pluto in the 12th. Ooh, we have to talk. I would like to know more about your Pluto in the 12th. I'm glad you guys feel this. 
Um, I'm going to do one more. Ooh, I'm feeling Aries. We got it good right now. I think we should quit while we're ahead. I'm going to do... We're going to do one more Oracle card because you can't go wrong with Oracle cards. I love these. So I'm I wanted I'm doing it. I'm going to do a tarot deck and an oracle deck. So please, if you know people that are illustrators, please, please, please inbox me their info because the one person that I would love, love, love to do my tarot cards, I think that they're so fucking booked that they can't even. It's heavy. I feel it. I love my Aries family. Husband, daughter, mother. Oh, Aries are the best. Mo fire. All right. All right. Mo, Mo fire. All right. So let's do it. And for anybody that missed the peacock, I'll reread the peacock. Messages for Aries. Denial. <laughs> Let's make the best out of this one, Aries. I acknowledge my fear, but I replace it with the insight of awareness. You know, it's amazing how when we know that we have to respect certain individuals and we know we can't act a goddamn fool, how this fear subsides. <laughs> Very interesting. I don't even think we allow the fear... I think that maybe, too, the other thing is we trust that person for whatever reason. And maybe it's due to the ties that we have. I'm telling you, those neighborhood ties and family ties are strong. Unless you have somebody that's just really off their rocker. It sounds like it's raining, but I think it's just this. I don't even know. Don't even get me started. And surrender. Pretty cards. I can release my need to control. And that is how it feels when you're dealing with someone who actually respects you too. And that you respect. You can surrender. Hi, Naisha. I did, I did Sagittarius already. So, I mean, Aries, denial and surrender. You know what I feel like too? I feel like we deny ourselves true love when we don't surrender. And you know what? We like to hang on to things that we don't need and that no longer serve us. And that is control. I didn't think I was controlling at all until a tourist told me about myself. <laughs> uh -oh. I want a Millie Rock for y'all, but I gotta be on that beat. Juju on that beat. That beat. <laughs> All right. So I have fun with y'all, Aries. I love y'all. All right. Until next time. Oh, please, 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 guys. Subscribe to my new channel, please. I have Paradox Report, but I have so many, so many fantastic videos on Paradox Report from when we used to do the talk show, which was hella fucking funny. Um, which I would love to do again, but I can't find people that are consistent enough. Um, that used to be a, a blast. Um, Kanika Jenkin videos. Love you too. Mwah, mwah, mwah. I hope everything is fantastic, Yolanda. Um, and all my Aries. But what was I saying before that? Y'all know I'm a burnout. I don't remember. You gotta tell me what information I'm supposed to inbox you. Oh, the King of Pentacles. Yes, just remind me. The King of Pentacles and the Four of Wands. I don't remember what I was saying before that. Burnout City. Let's see. Is it raining? I 
right, guys. I was gonna tell y'all something else. I don't remember. I'll remember once the video's over and I watch it back. Oh, that's what I was telling y'all. <laughs> Please subscribe to my new channel. It's called Hypnosis Tarot. H Y P G N O S I S. Hypnosis, like gnosis. G N O S I S. All right, all right. Hypnosis Tarot at YouTube.com. But yeah, I had Kanika Jenkins videos up there. Then this hating ass bastard Planet of the Fake started reporting my Kanika Jenkins videos and jeopardizing my channel. It was just not a good look. So now we have Hypnosis Tarot. All right, bye guys. Now next is um Earth. Earth signs next. <laughs>